Hey guys, let's do a quick overview of the all new Router 11, a high precision router that's a cross between a spindle and a standard router. It uses precision bearings, ER11 collets, and has a whole bunch of really cool accessories designed specifically for CNC. So let's do a quick unboxing and check out what this thing can do. First of all, this is not just a router in a box, this is a kit, really nice box. It has both US and European versions. Let's go just check out what's inside. Comes with a really nice manual. Go through that later. It comes with a cool aluminum reduction ring. So that's really nice if you're using, say, an open build to mount. You need to bring this down to a 65 millimeter. This will slide right into the open build to mount. You can slide the router 11 right inside of that. So that's great. And it comes with four ER11 collets. So from quarter inch to one eighth to three millimeter and last but not least, the six millimeter. So that's really nice. It covers a lot of range of bits that you can use. Now let's just pop this thing out. Pop this out of here. Because the CNC runs for a long time, it comes with several brushes. So you can see we have four brushes here. They get replaced oops, right here on the side. And it also has two more in here. So you get a total of six brushes. This thing will last forever. And it comes with a spanner wrench, which is nice. Little hole in the back so you can hang it. Let's check out the monster itself. So you can see here, it's just a really nice piece of machinery. It's like a work of art. It's got a redesigned shaft, it has NSK bearings in here, high precision. This has been turned down to make sure it fits an ER11 collet, which it does. You can see I have one in here now. This is a quarter inch one. So no more putting precision collets onto a router shaft that's not precision. So this is just really nice, it has a little, plunger here on the side that you press in to, to engage the lock so you can turn the nut. You can see that right there. On off switch. Also a variable speed control on the top from 10,000 to 32,000, number six, RPM. So 10,000 is really nice to have when you're doing things like aluminum and some of the harder materials. And the other thing is this has an electronic speed controller in it, so it's always monitoring the shaft's rotation. Let's say you're cutting through material and your bit's not very sharp, this will try to maintain that speed. Or if you hit a knot as you're going through wood, it's not gonna bog it down, it's gonna ramp it right back up and you'll hear that ramping as you turn it on. It's also pretty quiet. Go ahead and plug it in for you guys. Let's see what it sounds like. This is on one, so 10,000 RPMs. Doesn't sound bad at all. Now you can ramp up to, to 32,000. Really nice. Got a built-in fan here blowing down, keeping everything cool. Just a really all-around great kit for CNC. Go out and grab one. Let's see what cool things you can make with it. We hope you enjoyed the overview of the all-new Router 11. We look forward to seeing the project you create with it.